Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with our last filler, the only filler actually, for 2023, uh, for Leaf Pearl, that is. The filler box is 2023 Topps Chrome Black Baseball. So we're just gonna do the break itself, and then uh, after this, we'll re-randomize everybody's names, and the top two will get into that Leaf Pearl break, which will be in a different video. Big thanks to Gary, Chad, Matt Arnold, Matt Grell. Thank you. All teams are in, so let's do the break itself first. Let's roll it, randomize it. One and a two, three times each. One, two, and three. Yeah, that seems to be the obvious choice, right? Prove me wrong saying Vrabel going to the Patriots. I would love Vrabel to just be a defensive coordinator again. Yeah. But he's going to be a great coach. He's not, he's not the problem. One and a two, three times for the uh, teams. One, two, and three. Yeah, that seems to be like the most obvious fit if, if uh, Belichick ends up parting ways with the Patriots. Would he take a defensive coordinator job with him? No, right? Especially not if he gets head coaching jobs. I mean, at that point, I mean, Belichick should be like, yeah, I'll bring Vrabel as a DC, Josh McDaniels as the OC, <laughs> and it'll be back, back to normal again. Yeah. He might try to pitch what that. What are the Raiders going to do, huh? I hope they keep... Antonio Pierce, yeah. and then just hire some a good offensive coordinator. Yeah, you know? hire people around because I don't think he has. To, I don't think he has to play call. Yeah, no, he just he's just the motivator. Yeah, guy. Like, exactly. Like Dan, I mean, he's like a, Dan Campbell. Like Dan Campbell, really, honestly, he's just gonna get you there. You know? Yeah. All right, so Grell has all the teams except for Chad Wright. You got the Rangers. Matt Arnold, you have the Twins, and Gary, you got the Cubs. No trade windows, let's just print and rip, and then we'll re-randomize that list a little bit later. All right, so there is a pack underneath here. All right, there's a Ryan Mountcastle. Paul Goldschmidt, gold, 47 out of 50. And a Vinny Pascantino rookie card. I just saw an interview with him on MLB Network earlier today. Seems like a good dude. Working his way back from a shoulder issue. Could be part of uh, the Royals' turnaround. All right. The encased. What do we have here? Ooh, a bat. And it's the bat of Jeter Downs. Rookie autograph of the Nationals, Matt Grell with that one. He, he was a pretty highly touted prospect. He was part of that Mookie Betts trade. He's bounced around a lot now. He now he's with the Nationals. I don't know how he's looking with the Nationals, but he could be a late bloomer. He was a hot prospect for, for a little while. All right. Nothing too crazy in there, but let's see who's going to win those uh, pearl spots for a fraction of the price. Let's gather everybody's names, new dice, new list. Let's roll it and randomize that list six and a one, seven times. Good luck. Fingers crossed. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven, well, we see Chad, Matt, and Gary's name there already, so... Matt Grell did have the odds on his side. You've got a couple spots right there. We'll see you in the next video for that break. Thanks, everybody. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Bye-bye.